It's very beautiful. I wear it because it's very cold outside. And I'm going to learn reading for vocabulary words. Level C, lesson five. We teach your brown start. Have you ever learned with him? Um, I think so because he teach you and me a lot of words. He teach you and me a lot of vocabulary too. Now let's learn with him. Reading for vocabulary words. We teach your brown start. And never work a warm day. Hello, we go over lesson five and look at Brian. He's very handsome. Never a warm day. Never a warm day. We're not going to learn some place that has many, many warm. But we want many warm days. That's good. Focus on, let's learn about the Arctic. Let's learn about the Arctic. The Arctic is very cold. Hmm? The Arctic is very cold. If you make a room in the Arctic, and you see in the Arctic there are a lot of snow. If you make a room in the Arctic, a month, huh, you will not see the road anywhere because it's of the snow. And polar bear penguins live in the Arctic. Okay, frost is a covering of ice. <laughs> Look, it's so beautiful. Huh? Just it looks just like a flower. It looks like a flower, but if there one frost, we see that it looks like a flower. Many frost, we don't see that it looks like a flower. It's a covering of us. Liked by many people. Oh, she's famous. And she has blue eyes. She's very beautiful. And like I said, I answered the question. Famous or popular? Popular. She's very famous and popular. I like her very much. But do you know her? No. Do you know? I don't know. Far away. And this is where you live. There's your dog. I don't live in that. I live in the building. And far away. Far away can remote. 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 Remote can. It means it's far away. It's far away. It, um, my building is. Far from something like um, if I go to my grandma's house, that's far from my grandma's house. It's very far and very far. Okay, not comment, huh? She eating her, her keyboard. Not comment. So she is unused to her. In honor, that's. The word unusual too. She's not common. I don't. Um, I think some pe most people might eat their keyboard. She think her keyboard is is candy. One. So we can say one. One. You can say unusual and one. So that's the word. To say that something will happen in the future. This, this is a beautiful picture. It's very beautiful. I love that. For the far tune, it's the far tune teller. If, if the far tune tells something, it will happen in the future. So it um what? It's what? It's a fortune teller.
Just say that something will happen in the future is project. 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 Yes, I know her. Uh, you know her? But some, some man can do that. And some woman. What's the sound? Paris. To give up life. Oh. Go out. To give up light is the sun. The sun shine. Shine. Sh sh shine. Be careful of an S and S and S. So if we put them together, sh is the word sh. And we can have shine, shine, shine. Be careful with an irregular verb. If we have the word shine, we have an other word, we can say that an irregular verb. It's what? extremely cold. He looks like an ice cream, doesn't he? <laughs> but it does look like but it does look like a small igloo. <laughs> That's very fun. He extremely cold. That's very cold if you are the artist. Another word for extremely is frigid. Frigid. It's frigid. Frigid. Something that is completely different. Is or female? No. Something that is completely different in Twitter said sometimes people said yes, that's true, but some people said no thanks. They are opposite. 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 Is a post Hmm. A post is this people and this people and this people. A person who visits a place for pleasure. Oh, it's a beautiful place. If we go to that place, if we go to that place, you see people look at the beautiful buildings, walk in the beautiful bridge, many beautiful cars. Uh, driving in the beautiful road, many beautiful houses. That's pretty, that's good. But a, it's a person who visits a place for pleasure is a tourist. If, tourist, if you visit this, this, if you visit this town, you will see that you need a tourist. A book of story for children. For children, you use stories and books. We use story for we use story and books. So we say it is story book. An area of the earth is an area of an earth. What is the area of the earth? Do you know? If this picture is land, land. No, we say I in the area around the North Pole. Ah, oh, that's so easily. It's this place and you see it's very big. If we live in that place. <laughs> Do you know what I'm doing? I'm shivering, shivering because it's very cold here. And this is another place, but we're not talking about that place. We're talking about the North Pole. Santa lives in the North Pole. Yes. Arctic. So it's called an Arctic. Don't speak. Don't speak the word sea. We don't say Arctic. We say Arctic. Arctic. We don't. We speak fast. If we speak, um, say slow, we have the word see. 
Okay, Octi. We say that. In the place of something or somebody. Instead that. Oh, I just said it. In, instead. Instead. Be careful of D. D, D. Instead. Hey, that's it. Mm -hmm. that, that's it. Is that the word instead? What we write over the snow and ice? What we write over the snow and ice? If you um, put out the snow and you uh, wrote, see, you see that road and you see. Um, a month. There's no road anymore because it's of the snow. So people use this. It's called a sled. People use dogs to pull the sled. To pull the sled. We don't pull it. It's very heavy. If we have the engine and we do that. Um, I know. Santa have a sled. A small round house make us know. Oh, it's have the word I. The letter I is it a small round house make us know. Do you know that place? You know this is because you might build this. They call outside in the Arctic. You might build this. It's an igloo. Igloo. And you see, it's very, um, be careful of an oo, igloo, oo, igloo, to send sounds, to send sounds. I could hear something very small. It's that. I can hear something in the hallway. Oh! I'm hearing, of course, I just said the word hearing, hearing, hear, hear, so we can say hear, hear, hurt, 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 that means you hear it, be careful, it's an irregular verb, okay, to say sound, it's here, I hear it. And I learned it's all finished. It's fun to learn with brand stuff, doesn't it? And the next time I learn, so I will teach you more vocabulary and words. See you next time.